hey everyone welcome back to my channel so before we get into the vlog i just wanted to come on really quick and share with you all a few new fragrances that i received from dacier so they reached out to me and asked if i would like to try some of their fragrances and i was like absolutely because i am definitely a fragrance girl i have tons of fragrances both high end and low end so they basically let me choose the notes that i like so they sent me like a long list of all of the different fragrance notes so i chose the ones that i like the best and they chose the fragrances for me and so you basically get a little card with the description of the fragrance so this first one is a fruity honey and the notes are black currant green leaves honey nectarine and peach and this fragrance is actually inspired by joe malone's nectarine blossom and honey cologne and i actually have owned this fragrance before and i must say it does smell just like it so basically you get a full-size bottle like this but they also include a little sample as well so instead of using the full-size bottle they send you a sample to try out if you like it you can keep it if you don't like it just send the bottle back and you can just keep the little sample so basically all of their fragrances are inspired by high-end luxury fragrances for a fraction of the price like so affordable and if you know anything about fragrances you're basically paying for the name and the packaging a lot of these bottles are very extravagant and just like mind-blowing as you can see dossier just use very simple minimal bottles which i personally love um, so here's what it looks like just very simple does have a magnetic closure top so that's really nice and it's just very aesthetically pleasing so this fruity honey is definitely one that I can see myself wearing like all spring and summer I don't typically do fragrances based on the season but this just screams spring and summer to me because it's just so like fruity and just fresh and just nice so definitely love this and I'm actually going to be wearing this today and the next one that they sent me also with a little card this one is a woody ginger and the notes are ginger lemon bergamot pepper orange blossom violet leaves amber cedarwood and tobacco so here is what the little card has on the back it is inspired by tom ford fragrance again you get a full size bottle as well as a little sample this smells amazing it's so like masculine and just so good so definitely love this now this one is definitely one that i would consider like a date night fragrance or like an evening fragrance like if you're going out with your man or you know whatever um so yeah love 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 this again packaging is just so nice again these fragrances are cruelty free clean ingredients and no markups so you're basically getting high-end inspired fragrances for a fraction of the price which i personally think is amazing this is like genius to be honest um because again you're obviously just paying for the name and the packaging when you get other high-end fragrances definitely check them out they have a wide range of fragrances that are inspired by iconic scents and who doesn't love a nice luxury fragrance so again i will leave a discount code below for you guys so you can get some extra savings let me know if you all check them out and i'm interested to see if you all have some favorites that i should try out because i have been like all over this site and they literally have so many good fragrances so yeah guys those are the fragrances that i wanted to share with you all today oh again thank you to dossier for sponsoring this portion of the video all right guys so i am 
in the car now. I'm sitting in my driveway. I am getting ready to run to Nordstrom really quick because my Tory Burch sandals that I just bought went on sale. When I ordered them, they were, I think with tax, I paid $265 and they're on sale for like $190 right now. So I'm definitely going to get a price adjustment because I need all my coins. So I'm gonna do that. And then I wanna stop by uh, Target and just look for like some lightweight, little like sleep shirts, not gowns, but just like those little like button up like sleep shirts. So I wanna see if I can find a couple of those um, because I think those will be good for like after um, I give birth as well. Um, Cause I do plan to nurse again with this baby. And so the buttons really come in handy. Like I don't wear pajamas. So little sleep shirts are pretty much like what I wear. So, so yeah, I'm gonna run a Nordstrom. I don't know, I might look around. I might, I don't know, it depends on like if it's crowded or not, but I'm literally gonna park right by the shoe department and do my little transaction I've already called. Um, and they said, just bring it in and they'll make the adjustment for me. Uh, I did look on the website to see if there was like anything in store that I might be interested in, but there's nothing. I don't want another jogging suit. Uh, I really don't need any more dresses right now. Although I did just order another dress on Amazon. It's super cute. So yeah, that's what we're going to do. Um, Nordstrom and Target. So let's go. So I'm just leaving out of Target and I found one sleeve shirt and a sweater, but it's fine. I'll just keep looking. Uh, and I did get the rest of Sefton's stuff for his Easter basket because Easter is two weeks away. So I got his Easter basket stuff out of the way. And yeah, so now I am getting ready to head home and fix me something to eat. I'm really like craving nachos and there's like a Taco Bell right there, but I'm not going to Taco Bell. I'm gonna make them myself at home because I think I have everything. I may need to stop at Whole Foods actually. Yeah, I, yeah, I do. So. I'm gonna stop at Whole Foods and get the stuff that I need to make my nachos. And that's what I'll be having for lunch slash dinner. Cause it's not quite dinner time yet. But yeah, so, and when I get home, I'll show you guys a little sleep shirt and sweater that I got. Cause Target was a bust. So, all right. All right, y'all. So I am back home now and I have all of the stuff that I need to make my nachos. Got some ground turkey here, my favorite tortilla chips, some salsa. Got some of these nacho sliced jalapenos cause that sounded nice. And I just picked up a pack of taco seasoning. I already have lettuce, cheese and sour cream in the fridge. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this started and I'll show you guys how it looks when I'm done. All right guys, so here is the sleep shirt that I picked up from Target and it was $19.99 and it's just really nice and soft and it literally feels just like my um, robe that I wear. So I got this and it does have buttons and then um, I also got this sweater. Um, this is the receipt for my price adjustment that I got. I got $50 back, y'all. So it was definitely worth me going back and um, doing that. So I did that. So here are the shoes. I also got this sweater from Target. I just thought it was really cute. It's just like a little pink cardigan. And it was $28. So I just thought it was super cute. And then um, I ordered some bras off Amazon because 
I was going to buy the Skims Maternity um, Bras. And I was looking at some reviews on YouTube and a few YouTubers mentioned that the bras run extremely small and the sizing is just really weird. And so one of them recommended these. And so I bought them. They come in a pack of three. You also get these extenders um, for the back just in case um, it's too tight. They are really, really nice. They do have padding, but you can take it out if you want. So it comes in this like light peachy pink color, nude and black. They also give you these little rings. I guess you can like put this through here and there. So yeah, they feel really, really nice. The quality feels really good. Um, and again, they are nursing bras. So that's just a little tip that I learned from my first pregnancy. Um, my boobs get really, really large when I'm pregnant, like double D. And instead of me going out and buying new regular bras, I just buy nursing bras because this is pretty much what I'm going to be wearing after I give birth. So why not just go ahead and invest in some nursing bras that you can wear now and you can wear it later. Um, so that's just a little tip to me. Don't buy regular bras. Like don't go up a size in regular bras. Just buy nursing bras is what I would recommend. So I haven't tried them on, but they seem like they'll be really nice and secure. And yeah, so got those and I'll let you guys know how I like them, but I will leave a link to them below. You get like three for $16, so not bad at all. Um, it's actually really good. And just undo it, and then you just snap it back, and that's that. So, yeah, that's, that's all I got. All right, so my meat is ready. I just put my chips in a little pasta bowl. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and put the meat on top of the chips. And it's very important that you have a nice meat to chip ratio. All right, so now I am going to melt this by just putting it in a microwave for about like 10 seconds. So I got my salsa and jalapenos added. I didn't add a whole lot of jalapenos, but I do like spicy. I added a lot of salsa because I love salsa. Um, so I'm going to add some shredded lettuce and some sour cream. All right, guys, so here are my nachos. And I just added a little bit of parsley on top. And yeah, it's gonna be so good. I cannot wait to eat this. So yeah, guys, that's gonna do it for today's vlog. I'm just getting ready to enjoy my nachos, catch up on some TV. I need to catch up on Queen Sugar because I'm like one or two episodes behind. So I'm gonna watch that and just chill out and relax for the rest of the evening. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll catch you on my next video. Bye.